on today's video i am going to be showing you how to make a very perfect fufu make sure you watch to the end hi guys welcome back to my page so guys today we are not eating today but i'm going to be showing you how to make fufu there was a video i made few days ago and someone leave it on my comment section and ask how to make fufu and i reply her and i told her i will be uploading the video next week so this is the video guys so once you put your water on your cooking gas and the water is already cooked just as you saw it earlier on the water was boiling earlier on so you just add yam powder this is yam powder i'm using on this video you can use the plantain powder you can use the cocoa yam powder but on this video i am using yam powder already made yam powder this is what we use here in europe so guys once your water is boiled you just add your yam powder a bit by bit so that it will not be too strong in your hand so you add it bit bit by bit and start stirring it okay make sure you watch this video to the end so that you will understand how to make a very perfect fufu so guys this is the already made yam powder that i'm using on this video to make this fufu so it's on the bucket you can see it's almost empty this is what i always use okay it's one of my favorite so to get a very perfect fufu you need to add water gradually some people make their fufu it will be very strong i don't like it when it's very strong i like it when it's very soft it is more easy for your kids to eat when it's very soft so i'm going to be adding water gradually so that it will get soft as you can see this pot is a little bit too small for the quantity of the fufu that i'm making right now i am used to it so if you want to make your own fufu if you are a beginner make sure you get a bigger pot so that you will have a lot of space when you are mixing your fufu it will not be too difficult for you to stir okay so for me i am used to it so once you are done stirring the next thing you should do is to add water this is what i'm going to be doing right now add water and let it cook for at least five minutes so i'm going to be adding a little bit of water and i will cover it to cook for about five minutes so guys if you are new in my page don't forget to like and follow my page just to support me okay so guys we are back after five minutes so i'm going to keep stirring it stirring it until you see it missed properly okay keep stirring it until you see it missed properly at this point make sure your gas is very low so that it will not get burnt about a year ago i made a video like this on my youtube channel on how to make fufu i guess this person that leave this comment on my page does not follow me on my youtube channel that's the reason why she didn't see the video so guys if you have not following me on my youtube channel please try and follow me on my youtube channel at mama africa and family okay follow me on my youtube channel so that whenever i drop any new video you will be the first person to also notify so when you are done missing this is how your fufu should looks a very perfect fufu you see how soft and fluffy the fufu is very fluffy and is very soft so just cut it and put it in a paper wrap or in a plastic wrap wrap it and when you are eating it you will enjoy it the way you wrap it you will enjoy it better like this okay i hope you enjoy watching this video if you do don't forget to like don't forget to like and follow my page for more video see you in my next one bye